So today's tutorial is going to show you how Measure Square partnered up with Spec Intel to make your life just a little bit easier. One of the things we discovered after looking at over 2300 projects was about 30% of the information that you receive as an estimator from the architect is either incomplete or inaccurate. So how do I populate my job? Spec Intel has a database of over 700,000 products. Uh, so we use a dynamic search tool. We found that 30% of the information that's given to the flooring contractor from the A&D community is inaccurate, incomplete, or just plain wrong. So if I put Shaw Contract in, this system automatically makes a dynamic. I put the number 5 in. This is every product that Shaw has in their database that has a number 5 in the product number. Okay. As I start plugging more numbers in, you can see that it actually narrows down my search. Uh, I've got 14 options, 15 options. I can hit search. There they are. Now, if I want to narrow this down a little bit more, I simply hit this, uh, put in the color name, and there's what I want. Hit search again. Now I'm down to what I want specifically. Okay. So what's on this page? We have an image of the product. We have a link to the actual product page on the manufacturer's site. If you click on the manufacturer's name, you'll get to their home page. I can add it to my project below by clicking Add to Project. I can actually edit the product here. My product name my product number, the collection name, the color name, the color number, the backing information, the size information. And then on the right hand side you'll see the product ID that's in our system, the CSI number. If I click on four documents that takes you to a page that actually has all the documents. And then spec, in, spec check is actually probably the most important thing you see there. If it is spec checked, it has been run through our system and it validates that all the product data matches that product, including the documents. So that's a key, key feature to the platform. Uh, if I'm looking for, say, a tiling product, you'll see some additional fields pop up on the right-hand side. You'll see the finish. You'll also see the shape. Uh, and if I look down below, there's my bullnose base. So you'll start to see some of the trim pieces also that are in the system. So again, we have over 700,000 SKUs in our database from over 700 manufacturers, and we have over 2 million documents. Uh, so I've already created the job. I've added all my designations. I've added all my notes. So I'm going to simply click the icon that's a little arrow that points to the right on my right side toolbar. I'm going to select Measure Square. And I'm going to download a file that's now formatted specifically for Measure Square. So I'm going to move into my Measure Square platform. I'm going to right click on the project or product uh, tab. I'm going to select Import Export. And because we worked with Measure Square, this is a Measure Square file. So simply select the Import Measure Square file. There it is. Now, this particular job is a little bit smaller than the one I built. I just wanted to make it easier to load uh, from a timing standpoint. So it's going to load about six or seven products. It shows you what products loaded. If there are any errors, it'll show you that as well. Now, the system pulls in the product designation, the manufacturer's name, the collection name, color name, color number, product number, everything you really need. You can keep the list view open up on your other window, and then I'll also give you the uh, sizes of the products, and you can plug those in. Now, for those who have never used Spec Intel, once you have your job built, there's a lot you can do. We do a lot of lead documentation for our customers. You can upload your lead forms here. You can order samples in about 20 seconds there. You can actually create branded labels here in about 20 seconds. Here, you can actually make 26 different kinds of technical binders from submittal packages, closeouts, so forth. You can download all your specification sheets here. That's my export button to go to Measure Square. And I can download an image of the palette. Or if I need help, I can click that button. We're just a phone call away. So thank you Measure Square for working with us.